Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. I wanted to do a current favorites because I haven't shared my favorite products in a very long time. I thought I would do a video compiling all of my favorite beauty products, jewelry, clothing, miscellaneous products. I should just title it things TikTok inspired me to buy. The grip that TikTok has on me and my wallet it's ridiculous. I'm running out of daylight, so we'll jump into it. First, I wanted to thank the sponsor of today's video, which is Ana Luisa. I've literally been wearing Ana Luisa jewelry for years. I have earrings, necklaces, bracelets, rings. So I'd be surprised if you've never heard of Ana Luisa, but they are a sustainable jewelry company. A lot of their pieces are very versatile and fit so many different people's styles, but they also have more unique pieces. Their pieces do start at $39 and range to higher prices. So you can get 10% off with my code at JuliaK10. I'll link all the pieces down below that I'm showing. So I got three pieces and I'm wearing the other two, but I got these beautiful larger gold hoops. I wore these to a wedding and I love them. I just love very minimalistic jewelry, but these are still so eye-catching and pretty. You could wear these with literally any outfit. These are the Tia medium gold hoops. These are the Kian hoops. The other piece I got, I actually have stacked. I'll show it up close. This one has four little studs and I just love the geometrical look of it. This ring is the Mavis Mini. All their jewelry comes with these little jewelry bags. They have little magnets that close them. Super easy to just toss your jewelry into them to throw them into your suitcase or your purse or wherever you're carrying your items. So their pieces are perfect for any occasion for yourself if you wanna treat yourself or even if you wanna treat a family member or a friend to some new jewelry. They have so many pieces, gold, silver, sometimes rose gold. It just depends on their current inventory. You do have to kind of check the website frequently because one thing about Ana Luisa's sustainability is that they don't mass produce, which would cause for overproduction. So they don't have a ton of material left over. So you have to frequently check the website just to see what kind of new styles they have. They're constantly coming out with new styles. You can also sign up for their newsletter so you can get alerts when their new styles come out. And they also have exclusive sales all the time. They are a more affordable jewelry option, but that doesn't sacrifice the quality. I have never had any issues with my earrings or my rings. My rings don't turn my fingers green. I wear these at work when I sanitize and wash my hands often. They hold up like they're brand new. So if I haven't convinced you enough, Go check out Ana Luisa, truly my favorite jewelry company. You'll never hear me say it enough. So thank you so much to Ana Luisa for sponsoring this part of the video. Everything will be linked below if you want to shop their website or even some of the pieces that I showed in this video. So next, I will move on to beauty related products. So I saw this one on TikTok and so many people mentioned that men in specific will come up to them and be like what are you wearing you smell so good and i've seen three different people on three different tiktoks say the same thing so i don't know if it's just a way of them branding to get people to buy it but they sold me on it i bought it i love it I would go up to a girl and be like, what are you wearing? You smell good. If I smelled her wearing this. This is the Glossier U perfume. It's so good. I've also been loving the Tarte Shape Tape cloud coverage. I think this is technically considered foundation. It has a broad spectrum SPF 15 in it, so a light SPF wear. I think that this is very buildable and I don't really hear people talk about this one very often, but I struggle with patchiness with foundations. So the fact that this one doesn't do that for me is great. It's also moisturizing, it's still dewy. I like it a lot. I think it's also very buildable. So I don't hear many people talk about this one, but I like it. Of course, have to mention the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. This is my second tube that I've repurchased. I love it. The Fenty Beauty Invisimat Blotting Powder has also been great. I like to use it on my under eyes. It's great blotting powder. If you're more oily, get this. I usually put it under my eyes and then my T-zone. It's great. I have mentioned this before, but I've been using this since 2018. I love this mascara. I have tried so many different mascaras and I will always go back to this one. I'm sure you all have heard of it. It's Thrive Cosmetics Mascara. It's a tubing mascara, so when you wash your face, you can just slide it right off your lashes. You don't have that running raccoon effect when you get your eyes wet, but it does kind of come off in like spider legs. I don't think they sell this at Ulta or Sephora or anything. I just buy it straight from the website. It's amazing. It's called Liquid Lash Extensions. Another lash product is Grande Lash. It's the Lash Enhancing Serum. I started using this when I got my lashes off just to make them a little more fluffier and fuller again after having lashes on for so long, but I love this. You do have to use it very consistently. I like this better than Babe Lash because it does not make your skin itch. 
I struggled so much with babe lash, which used to be so popular. My eyelids would turn red and they were so itchy, but I heard it was actually a certain ingredient in the babe lash serum. Something with the fat cells, I don't know. I will not use the babe lash one. I am a ride or die grande lash stan. And the grande brow, you guys. I struggled with sparse brows for so many years. This brow is looking a little funky. We're going through a stage right now, just trying to get things to even out. But my right brow, I've never had such a nice right brow. I didn't do a very great job today of filling them in, but they are distant cousins. But the Grande Brow Serum is amazing. Makes them so fluffy. And then I also use the Just For Men Mustache and Beard Dye to tint my eyebrows. Every time I go to get my brows tinted, they always turn out so much darker than I want them to be. So I've been using this for a few years. I actually did a video maybe like two or three years ago using this product and I used the wrong shade. So my eyebrows were very dark, but you get the gist of it in that video of how to use it. I can do this about every two weeks, but I think I didn't leave it on for long enough last time because I need to fill in the tail a little bit. Also, yes, I did chop my hair. Not loving it, not hating it. It's just... It's just hair, it's gonna grow. And I do have little tinsels in there somewhere. I don't know if you can see them. There they are. I got them at this little event at my cycle studio. And uh, yeah, now I still have them. Something fun for the summertime. So this is another one of my favorites. More beauty favorites. This is the Sol de Janeiro Beja Flor Elasti Cream. Oh my gosh, this smelled amazing. Oh, so good. It almost reminds me of the Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume. I think it's the Cloud Perfume. It kind of reminds me of that. And then also the Brazilian Cross Cheirosa Body Mist. I love the warm scent. I don't know what it is. So good. Couple more beauty products and then we'll move on to clothing. Of course, the Bosch & Loam Lumify Eye Drops. Use these sparingly, but I cannot believe what they do to your eyes. I have some pretty prominent blood vessels that are always super red. Your sclera of your eyes just gets so white with this. It's crazy. I love it. My aunt is also obsessed with it too. And then the Plus White 5 Minute Speed Whitening Gel. I saw this on TikTok as well. And I have very sensitive teeth. I can't use any other teeth whitening product because I get the zingers really badly. If I have the Crest White Strips on for two minutes, I get the zingers of pain. Those are a no for me, but this is great. It also comes with like a little tray. I don't have that with me. Next up, we'll move on to these cute little workout tanks. They're from Amazon and they have like the double strap with the twisted back. I can't remember where these are dupe from. I don't know if it's Halara. I have no idea. But these are so cute in my opinion. They kind of feel like a line material. I love athleisure stuff, so those are so cute. And then this is so random, but these are some sweatpants from Old Navy. I don't know the specific name of them, but I'll link them below. They're just like a jogger style comfy sweatpant and they're so soft. They're like a heathered gray color. Get them, they're so good. Also Abercrombie has been a favorite. This little top is from Abercrombie and then this is gonna be weird, but these shorts are also from Abercrombie. All of my jeans are from Abercrombie. They've just improved everything so much. So I know everyone has been raving about them. Last but not least, I have been loving reading again. I was into reading a lot when I was working as a gymnastics coach back in 2018. And I worked four hours in the morning, four hours at night. During those four hours, I had nothing to do. So I sat outside and read a ton, but I'm currently on Verity very very good book i read ugly love before this book and i wasn't that big of a fan i just thought it was really rushed in the end but overall it was okay the beginning was just kind of slow for me but i'm loving verity so far if you guys want to ever chat about books with me i have a goodreads account otherwise you can always message me on instagram my all-time favorite writer right now is vi keeland the summer proposal and the invitation are two that i've read of hers that i love so i'm planning to buy more books from her i have like five books in my to be read list those are all of my favorites as of recently so if you guys want to shop anything that i mentioned everything will be linked down below also thank you so much again to ana luisa for sponsoring this video again you can use the code juliak10 for 10 percent off of your order they literally have the cutest jewelry also i forgot to mention i've been obsessed with doing my own nails and i kind of wish i would have done black with white stripes on this one but 
for another time. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you very soon in the new video.